Today we're examining sleep. How much sleep do you really need? And what happens when you don't get enough? Napoleon Bonaparte won several wars and conquered many nations despite only sleeping a few hours per night. The amount of sleep needed differs for everyone and depends on many factors including age and genetic makeup. In fact, how long you sleep might be linked to your DNA. Experts recommend that most adults should get seven to eight hours of Z's a night, but kids, teenagers, and young adults need more sleep than older people. Whether you're a night owl like Albert Einstein, or an early bird like Frank Lloyd Wright, sleep deprivation can negatively impact your health in both the long and short term. Sleep deprivation is associated with weight gain, weakened immune response, depression, cold and flu, type 2 diabetes, and other chronic health problems. Extreme sleep deprivation can produce levels of cognitive impairment equal to a blood alcohol level of 0.05%, which is the point above which you are driving while impaired in New York State. Research conducted at Mount Sinai's Integrative Sleep Center revealed a link between interrupted sleep and performance. Sleep-deprived mice perform worse in a balancing test than their well-rested counterparts. To maintain good sleep hygiene, habits and practices conducive to sleeping well on a regular basis, find out how much sleep your body needs for optimal performance. To figure this out, think about how tired you feel each day. If you sleep much longer during weekends and vacations than during a typical week, or if you start to fall asleep at your desk during the workday, it could be a sign that you're getting insufficient or poor quality sleep. If you feel concerned about your sleep hygiene, consider scheduling a sleep evaluation at Mount Sinai.